एवरीवन एंड थैंक यू फॉर ज्वाइनिंग अस टुडे वी आर सीइंग इनक्रेडिबल ग्रोथ हियर इन इंडिया अक्रॉस वेरियस सेक्टर्स आवर अर्बन लैंडस्केपेस आर चेंजिंग रैपिडली विथ एम्बिशियस प्रोजेक्ट्स लाइक हाई स्पीड रेल मेट्रो नेटवर्क एंड इंडस्ट्रियल एक्सपेंशन एंड विद दैट देर इज अज डिमांड for advanced anchor solutions to ensure the safety and longevity of these structures as the need for these solutions rises we have also seen a significant increase in the adoption of stringent safety standards in our construction industry however india has faced challenges due to lack of comprehensive design standard for post install anchors leading to inconsistencies and unfortunately some catastrophic failures in the past but now we have some great news the bureau of indian standard has introduced a crucial new code the design of post install anchors to concrete and this is a game changer for indian construction industry first it ensures regulatory compliance safety is at its core requiring anchors to undergo an extensive and stringent testing process this new standard provides a comprehensive design framework for post install anchors guaranteeing reliability and consistency second the standard aligns with the latest seismic safety norms did you know that nearly 60% of india's landmass is earthquake prone and 78% of our population lives in moderate to high risk zones hence providing a safe built structure is critical this new standard will set new benchmarks eliminate inconsistencies in anchor design and pave the way for a safer future At Hilti we are incredibly proud to support this evolution backed by extensive research and proven solution we are committed to delivering safer and value engineered connections giving you more peace of mind this is a welcome change for all of us and we deeply appreciate the bureau of indian standards for this revolutionary step towards safer infrastructure development in our country Now I would like to invite Pulkit to share more insights into the code. Thank you Jayant and hello everyone. With any new standard creating the right awareness is essential for seamless adoption. Anchors are often seen as simple steel pieces but they are much more. This standard highlights governing factors and to name a few different load conditions, concrete dimensions, presence of cracks in concrete and seismic activity these factors significantly impact the anchor performance but were sometimes overlooked in the past now it is time for a poll and the question for you is as per your assessment which of these factors are the most important ones which impact anchor behavior please share your views Thank you for sharing your insights. The right answer is that all of these factors are critical and one such factor is the presence of cracks in the anchor location. Post installed anchors experience a significant reduction in resistance when exposed to concrete cracks. And as we know, Indian concrete code assumes concrete members to develop cracks over their service life. As such, it becomes very important that the anchors are assessed and design for use in crack concrete now that we already know india is a highly seismic country so the next question that can come to your mind is how does this have an impact on the anchor performance in case of an earthquake of course these cracks become much more pronounced in the event of an earthquake which requires an even more stringent assessment and design of anchors used in high seismic zones let us now watch a video to understand how this is relevant
It is extremely important that an anchor exhibits proper crack retraction effect and delivers perfect load displacement under seismic loading. Seismic means crack cycling and load cycling by means of tension and compression forces acting on the anchor, while cracks in the concrete member are opening and closing. The crack retraction effect ensures that the sleeve keeps its position in case of seismic cracks. While the crack closes, the cone is pushed back to its original position. As you saw in the video, the anchor behavior is significantly impacted by crack cycles. It is also important to understand that earthquakes don't just impact main structural components. They also, in fact, threaten non-structural elements like fall ceilings, utility fixtures and building facades, especially in mission-critical facilities like hospitals and airports. This standard ensures that the connections are designed to perform safely and consistently for both structural and non-structural components, even during seismic events. I now invite Ashish to help us understand how Hilti can be your best partner in seamless adoption of this code. Thank you, Pulkit. Good day, everyone. At Hilti, we have always been known for our high-quality solution that meets the toughest industry challenges. The launch of this Indian standard is a monumental step forward. And we are proud to partner with you, the industry, to make this transformation seamless. As mentioned by my colleagues, the Indian standard requires post-installed anchors to go through stringent testing and assessment process that ensures highest safety and highest performance. Our high-performing portfolio of anchors has been developed and tested for exactly these conditions. And yes, you heard it right. Our anchors are pre-qualified to be used under the provision of Indian Anchor Code. Not just that, our cloud-based anchor design software Profis Engineering is also now equipped with the IES design method. This means you can design post-install anchoring connection that are not just compliant to IES code, but are also value engineered. But technology alone is not enough. Creating awareness is just as critical. Our team of technical experts is ready to support you every step of the way, from design to on-site execution. Through our upcoming webinars and workshops, we aim to empower you with the in-depth knowledge of Indian design code. Together, let's build a safer and more reliable infrastructure for India. Build a robust understanding of the code and ensure compliant designs by registering for our upcoming webinar series. Scan the QR code now. Thank you. Goodbye and good day to all.